Hello everyone, today I am going to talk on 4 super actionable advert tips to try right now. Advert tip number 1. You have to combine branded terms with modified broad keywords. You have to create keywords that are a combination of branded and non-branded terms. Set the non-branded term to modified broad using plus sign, but leave the branded term on broad. Using this technique, will allow your ads to show when people search combination of your non-branded terms. Your branded term do not have to be present. So for example, let's say that your branded term is heavy NRs and your non-branded terms are neon flip flops. You have added the keyword as heavy NRs plus neon plus flip plus flop and the ad could be eligible to show for search queries that include the word neon flip and flops why does this technique yield high quality score you have to remember google calculates your score based on exact matches to your keyword term because the official keyword technically includes your branded term it's likely to yield a stellar quality score advert tip number two Take advantage of location-based bid modifier. One of the best ways to fine-tune your advert account is to identify what's working and amplify it or promote your unicorn. One rule to do this is through location-based bid modifier. For too many advertisers set their targeting to reflect the areas where their products are sold. And neglect to revisit these settings rather than guesstimating which region are the most valuable for your business head to the dimension tab and set your view to geographic this will produce a sortable report that breaks down your performance metric by country region metro area city and most specific location organized by conversion to understand the region that are bringing the most sales for your business. Once you have identified your most valuable location, revisit your location targeting settings and set a positive bid adjustment for each of this location. Higher bids will help you to attain better visibility for searches located in or searching for products within your top location, ushering in even more conversions. Advert tip number 3. Reach beyond your current language setting. AdWord bases its language targeting setting on a Google user interface language. User can edit this setting to ensure that Google provides results in the selected language regardless of their physical location. Identify which languages are most prominent in your target region. Then adjust your language targeting settings to include this new audience. Grubhub has adopted this strategy perfectly. This is clearly a bilingual searcher. Her Google profile is set to Spanish but she is searching in English and Grubhub English ad should suit her just fine. Advert tip number 4. Salvage tying ad groups with remarketing list for search ad. Try Reselecting your ad group using remarketing list for search ad. With this feature, you can restrict its traffic by solely displaying ads to people who have already visited your site. Since they already know who you are and have shown an interest in your offering, they are more likely to be further along in the purchase cycle and ready to convert than your standard audio. If you decide to go to this route, it's crucial that you execute this properly. With remarketing list for search ad, your primary targeting criteria is still keywords. Your remarketing list is then layered in as secondary targeting method. When adding your remarketing list, you have the opportunity to set it to bid only or target and bid. In this scenario, be sure to select target and bid which limits your ad visibility to past site visitors. 
You can keep in touch with me at seomadhur at gmail.com. My Skype ID is madhur.bajaj. My WhatsApp number is plus 91-98502-76340. Please like my video and subscribe to my channel. Have a good day.